welcome back to this video in this video we are going to do something like we have done previously plotting a graph now in this i am showing you to load a bar graph it's not running in here let's see here is the tick enter window that we have already know that if you are if you don't know about tick enter then go to our videos let's add first element so here it is showing element is first and this is first now where is the window when i add second element suppose i add 13 let's see this is red and this is blue and when i add more second element and it is adding board this is adding and adding we will solve this in this video let's make a new file here and run it new i will save this on my desktop and desktop i will save as tk tk bar graph Here let's start before this we have to install a library called p install mat float lib i have already installed it and it will show me already satisfied and i have no internet connection so it may have problem yes it is showing me already satisfied now in this now first of all we will import all the file here we will need three things i will from tick enter i will import all the things and from the plot library dot by plot edge plot this is python plot of matplotlib this is matplotlib and from pylab this is also a matplot libraries package import plot so x level and y level this will help to plot the graph this will show what we plot this will represent the x component and this is y component of the variable let's first of all create window is equal to tk now window i will i will not set and i will set some geometry is equal dot i will set this as a square window and i will set this as 300 into 300 now simply make window title to bar graph now let's start making the window i will make three point for this first of all i will make first where equal to a string var this is string var second var is equal to 
thing where now I have deleted this and now let's make the input box for this first input is equal to entry and we have to pass we do this tiki object here and we should pass a text variable text variable is first here this means for this and we have to grade this to our window here we will I will use row is equal to zero this will use in the row zero cuadm and column is equal to zero and I will give pad x it padding of this object will be is equal to in the x axis 10 and pad in the y axis I will give only 5 let's give 10 and internal padding I will give pad y not up. internal padding I will give a 5 let's give 10 let's remove this and see what we have get let's here it is it is so small let's give padding here ipad y is equal to 10 let's see what the change is now this is a larger one now you can make this all of this i have already made this and let's see button i have made all button for this i have forgot just now first button is equal to button and this will be window and text should be given here i will give add first element or only this and we should give command command is equal to i will give lambda so that i could pass any variable load first graph here this command should be small let's see what we have get here now this video will be long but first button has not been graded same grade we will we can use this as grade and i will just copy this first button this UI this is not UIN and this row is equal to 0 because we have to add in row 0 now here we have to add something here it is giving error because we have not defined that let's define those input you can either define here or define inside it and this thing one thing we have to make this window dot main loop i have forgot to told you previously let's make it now for this i will make define first this load first graph here I will global first pair because I have to get data from this data is equal to float we have to get this in float value first where dot get simply we will get this data now thing is that we have to plot this for this we have a plot value pipe load this will plot this plot dot we have to make bar we have to pass the value suppose i have i is equal to to 1 
this means suppose this x axis is 1 and y axis I will make this as y now this is y then I have to put I have to make x and y value to pass and you can give label let's start give any label plot dot legend we are not using x level and y level now plot dot so now let's save and see what we will get here I will type 10 it is giving me 10 again I will type 11 it is giving me in same graph but I want to remove this no handle for x level and y levels it is giving me this let's make this here load that x level I will show this simply x axis as in the graph this is 2d graph load that y level y this is the value and now I want to make this let's make x global here x is equal to first of all I will make this x is equal to 0 now here x plus is equal to 1 and let's global this variable now run this Now let's add 10 here. Again, it is showing me x legend is not. We will concern later. X and y axis are given here, but legend is yes, levels here. This level is not axis. And let's we will make this later. Let's. 11 and it has been put this color is randomly picking we are not giving any color it is picking a random color we will handle this let's handle for first of all this and we will code for all the buttons now for this we have to add online more that is let's see that code to write this is we have to actually we don't need to add this here we have to add the point here you have to add level is equal to what we have to label I will label this is first and I will give color is equal to I will give this as red now this has been finished and this should be in below this now add this 10 now it is it is not showing any error for me now I will add 11 it is adding red for me again and 12 see here this is showing first 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 for this red 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 now let's code for this button just copy this and change the variable copy this paste and paste this is second where sorry for this this was not second where this is second where 
same thing goes to this and this is stored up there same thing goes to this I will name this as second purple third pink let's run it and see what we get here 10 sorry for this here third pair it is giving me some error I think I have code for button some next no this is no here I have made some mistakes really I have not changed any this function name now it will have 10 add now it has been add 20 let's add it and 5 let's add it again this is 15 I will add this first for this 20 no, this is 12 this is 15 first for I will add this this and this now it is adding and adding let's change again this to 14 15 and 10 let's make this I will make this now second, third and it is adding and adding. You can make this graph easily. Now in next video we will solve this first, second, third and this what is relevant coming to us. Thank you for watching this video. Let's meet in next video.